For me, it means variety, comprehension, flexibility, discovery, a rencontre, the fact that you have different approaches, nationality, always can only enrich and make you aware that there are other points of view. It's not always easy um, to accept and, more importantly, take advantage of these, these things, these differences. My team is intrinsically diverse. We have a, a common goal, and in order to reach this common goal, you need diversity. That this is a project which has already professional diversity needs. It's already from the work itself. I mean, it's, a pl it's about the plasma wakefield acceleration. You need engineers, you need technicians, you need detector physicists. So it's uh, diverse already in that in the professional context uh, in order to reach this common goal to set up or build this experiment. When I arrived at CERN the first time, we had this meeting with uh, with my supervisors and other people. So we were one Polish, one British, one uh, Australian. And we had this first meeting. It was really tough for me to understand them. I was actually understanding nothing. I had this one hour meeting when at the end, I just asked my supervisor to send me an email explaining me again what I had to do because English was okay. But even though when you just try to understand a new environment, and they were using different vocabularies. Even if we had exactly the same background, it was completely different. Diversity is very important for my team and for the youth service in the UC's office. Mostly because we serve a community which is uh, so rich in nationalities, in uh, professional backgrounds, but in education. For example, they have an age of 18 up to 92. This is different several generations. We have 100 different nationalities and uh, this brings in that uh, the team itself needs to handle all these differences. I assisted a visit to a guide who was an informatician explaining what we were doing in the experience. Toujours en se référant au concept d'information, parce qu'il était informaticien, il analysait tout comme des informations qui étaient transportées. Et c'était une façon euh, originale pour moi d'expliquer les choses. Et euh, ça m'a apporté une nouvelle façon de, de comprendre, une, une meilleure compréhension de, de la matière qu'on explique en fait. During the interview, it came out that this person was dyslexic. It turned out because he was given a job in graphics. And he came out with some unbelievable solutions to the problems we had. It was graphical display of information that was then presented to the operators. And I would say that the relationship, the working relationship with him was one of the most memorable, productive experiences I have ever had. I've never forgotten that. The effort and the miracle of CERN is to, 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 to put everyone in a very short time with the same mentality, independent where they come. And I think that's something we have to preserve. People listen to a new idea, open mind, independent where you come from, how bad is your English accent. And this respect is very important. Maybe for some people it's more difficult to listen to you because you are a woman. Uh, maybe for others it's more easy, but you feel the reception from the other people always. Sound, take part.